uh, shamisen competition, we saw that there were other young people like ourselves playing shamisen, and that was very inspirational for us. Uh, I was just wondering, because I, I listened to a few of your collaborations, and I was wondering which one was your favorite to work with. I think one song that showed us just how much potential there is in the collaboration of different instruments is uh, Change with Monkey Magic. Hello. Uh, I was just wondering, like, the process of how you make your songs, and especially when you're with the whole band, I was wondering, if you do, when you do you write some music down, like, uh, all of the instruments, the flutes and the guitars, etc.? Uh, it depends on the situation and the song, but of course the shamisen phrases, we write those ourselves, but there are occasions when uh, a professional music editor will come in and arrange the other instruments. Um, when you watch like Hi. when you watch a video of yourself, like how they show um, what do you feel like? Are you embarrassed to watch yourself or do you criticize yourself? Um, <laughs> 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 Well, when we're playing, we're too busy to feel embarrassed. But yeah, now that I think about it, <laughs> and the reason for that is because our mouths are always half open when we're playing. That's a very interesting idea. Um, there's actually a CD out there of an artist called Chikoria uh, that has a banjo in it, and we've heard that CD before and we like it a lot. When we uh, come into the U.S., we have a hard time explaining to customs just what a shamisen is. <laughs> so just to simplify things, we just tell them it's a banjo. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> uh, we do play the guitar on occasion. <laughs> Like when they wear the hakama, what are the different like parts called? The top part is just called the kimono, and the bottom is the hakama. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, 